So I got to ask this question today. How are people creating these emojis all over their iPhones and Facebook and all that stuff? So I figured I'd do a quick little video. So it's one of the, the one I use is called Bitmoji. And it's the most flexible. And I'll show you why I think it's the most flexible. And the way you get it is you go to the Apple Store and you search for Bitmoji down here. B-I-T. Click up here in this box and type in B-I-T. Click on Moji. And there it is right there, it's a green emoji, and you can see I've already downloaded it because it wants me to open it. So once you download it, you hit open. Now once you're in here, what you can do is go create an avatar. And you, when you create your avatar, it walks you through, look down here at the bottom of the screen, you'll see the color of your hair, you'll see do you have a mustache, what color are your eyes. Hey, wait a minute, what's this change the color of my eyes? I got them blue, a dark blue, blue. Yeah, you can decide to, you know, all of this stuff. You can put on glasses and you can change your glasses if you want. You have different style glasses. I don't like that. You know, what other glasses do I have? Where's other glasses? So, you know, you can have the shades. I like those glasses better. And then you, then you keep going. You scroll all the stuff across the bottom. And uh, I, by the way, you can keep moving through all the options by hitting this little arrow up top here. Oh, look at the eyeshadow. You can have blush. Oh my God, my lipstick. Ooh la la. You know, earrings or no earrings, you know, headwear, all by hitting this little arrow up top here. And then when you're done, you hit save. Okay? Now, once you, then it shows you all the different emojis you have that includes your Bitmoji character. Now let me show you how to use it. So if I'm in messaging or Facebook, I go to Facebook, let's go up here and dip the X and let's go find uh, there. I'm gonna go to her profile because she asked a question and I'm gonna come down here and she got that. Now I'm gonna show her me, okay? So there's her post, I'm gonna comment. Now, here's how I do it. You go down to the, uh, the globe in the bottom left, I hit the globe, and I go to Bitmoji keyboard. I get my Bitmoji, and then I can pick any one of these that I want to, air hugs. Now it copies it. So what you've got to do is get your cursor in there where it says right, click, hold it long enough for paste to come up, and hit paste, and then send. I don't like that I have to paste it, but it makes it more flexible. Anyway, that's how you do it. You can use this almost anywhere. I can go to messaging and a message. I can go send Sandra a message. I can go in here, hit this button down here and bring up my Bitmoji. And then, you know, I can go to my Bitmoji and I can go find thank you. Where's thank you? I can go to hit Hola Amiga. Okay, it copies it. Click in the message, hit paste, and then hit send. And again, I can send this, go back to the regular keyboard. I can use this Bitmoji anywhere I want. I just gotta change my keyboard to Bitmoji, hit, set, hit grab it, copy it, paste it, boom, waka waka, anywhere I want. Have I tried it in, in email? Let's try email. New message, let's do a new message. Let's send this to Lee. You gotta switch keyboards back to this. So I go in here, switch the keyboards to Bitmoji, hold it, switch to Bitmoji. And then I can go, you know, grab my little Bitmoji. It says, bless you, copied it, hold in here, get to paste, hit paste, and hit send. Now when that message comes in, if I click on it, I'll see that. Bitmoji, enjoy it and have fun. Don't get too wacky.